Whoa, 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 change my life. Yeah, sure, I'll take a pamphlet. Seems totally reasonable. Okie dokie. Alright. I explain using real science. I love science. Why we whites are under attack. Ooh. And what we must do to fight back. Oh. You, sir, are a real fool. I'm sorry. You just call me a fool? A fool! A fool! A fool! Actually, you know, folks, <laughs> he he got me. He's you know, you know, he got me. He got me pretty good there. Uh, you know, you, you know, that's, it, it's funny. You know, uh, you can laugh along with that. Ha 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 You know, folks, I, uh, I think that I disagree with him, but, uh, you know, sometimes you're going to disagree with somebody on something and you just have to tolerate them. Uh, and you have to tolerate their beliefs. And uh, if I'm not tolerant of his belief uh, that I'm a fool, then I'm willing to open the door to all kind of intolerance. And if there's one thing I'm not willing to tolerate, it's intolerance. Uh, so, you know, uh, even though I wouldn't consider myself a fool, uh, this gentleman, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tolerate his belief. Ha! 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 This Wild West, this lawlessness that exists. It doesn't really suit me. Uh, I don't think that I'm going to be able to tolerate it. Let's see, how do you solve massive crime and inequality? How did Bruce Wayne solve these problems in Gotham? Well, he dressed up like a bat and beat up some poor people. Huh. I don't think that's really my style. Let's see what the version of that would be from somebody who isn't mentally insane. Reach for the sky! Please, friend. You gotta help me out here. Whoa, 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 friend. Please. Looks like you just escaped from prison. A stereotypical prison. Yeah, sure, I'll help you out. Reach for the skies. You're going to jail. Alright, uh... I'm gonna be honest, I... I don't actually know where the jail is. Do you know? Um, oh hey, there's some cops. Hey, special delivery! Good morning, gentlemen. Don't mind me. Just doing my job. Uh, which is your job. For you. So there you go. Ride like the wind, bullseye. Hey, Polly, one ticket for Toy Story 4. Hey, this isn't Toy Story 4. Alright, there's a cloud. Wait, you guys leaving? You're gonna miss the post credit scene. But yeah, that movie was, uh, it was pretty good. I, I wouldn't give it a... Oh my, oh my god. You know, Rockstar... People give you a lot of credit for the uh, realism in your games. Uh, I gotta give this one a, a 10 out of 10. Very realistic. This is why so many people died in theater fires in the past. Because they just couldn't figure out how doors work. They'd never been in a theater before, so they, they didn't even know how to exit one. Uh, but uh, I'll admit this is getting kind of frustrating. Alright, move. Move! Fucking move! Just move! Jesus, lady! What are you doing standing there? Get out of here! Move! Move right now! I can't, I, d just, yep, yep, no, no, yeah, there we go, yeah, oh, what, now you like to leave? Oh, jeez, all right, you know what, I'm gonna talk to the manager about this, this is bullshit. And it's fucking locked, of course. Man, this is the worst fucking theater in the entire goddamn American South. Hope you had a nice time. I did not, sir. Go fuck yourself. Whoa, 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 whoa. You again? All right, all right, you know what? Tolerance is important, uh, and you know what? That, that fool thing, I've been ruminating on that, that's actually kind of funny. Ha! 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 the lasso. Reach for the skies. Don't mind me, officer. Ha! Just having a good laugh with my friend here. Ha! 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 I think it's interesting how nobody is stopping me for, uh, you know, having a dude lash the back of my horse. <laughs> like, everyone sees, nobody cares. Like, oh, he looks like Woody, it's probably fine. There's two cops, they're like, oh, he's probably got a good reason. Hey, it's a goat. Ah! Alright. Uh, <laughs> alright. Alright, alright, who's the wise guy? Was it you? Was it you? 
Oh, it was you, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Come here. Come here. Look, go. Hey, excuse me, sir. Sir. Yeah, I need to have a word with you. Listen, your animals are very angry. Uh, you know. Oh, is that a gun? Oh, you know what? Get that shit out of here. Not in my house. You know, animals often take on the personality of their owners, and uh, it's it's no wonder why these goats were so aggressive. Get out of here, goats. Be free. Live your life full and happy in the fields. Watch it, maniac. Watch hey, 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 hold on, hold on. Back this up. Watch it, maniac. All right, yeah, see that again? Right there. Right there, look. I'm not even, I'm not even gonna hit him and he jumps like 10 feet back. And he yells at me. All right, this guy, this guy is fucking stupid. You again? I guess the police must have let you go. You know what? I'm gonna help you out. Just this once, because I don't want to see you again. Just hold still. Wait, why does that give me honor? This guy could be like the biggest serial killer in American history. <laughs> you have no idea who this guy is. Uh, hey guys, I'm your host, uh, Woody from uh, Die Hard. Today we are going to pit uh, some jackass against uh, an apex predator, unchanged through millions of years of evolution, because it's already the perfect killing machine. Hey, Polly, delivery! <laughs> oh shit! Just what I thought. Jimmy, can we put another point on the board? There we go. Thanks, Jimmy. Well, that's it for this week, folks. Join us next week for another exciting episode of The Real Master Race. Until then, don't forget to spay and neuter your pets. Hey, Polly, give me a ticket for Shrek 47. The Germans have developed... A Finally, a weapon to surpass Metal Gear. What the time. fuck? It was nighttime when I went in, like five minutes ago. Hope you had a nice time. Oh, look who's back. Yeah, let's you talk. I just want to talk. Oh, just joking. calm down. I want to talk. Alright, alright, I just wanna talk. I just wanna talk. I just wanna talk to you. I just wanna shoot you. I just wanna talk to you. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? This man has captured these two proud horses and is forcing them to drive his wagon. I won't tolerate this. Get out of here. What, you got a gun? Get that shit out of my kitchen. This man will be tried for his crimes by the Parliament of Horses. The proud equine people will have their justice. You. You're free now. Go. Live your life. You're free now, my friend. Go. Live your life as free and as wonderful as you can. Now we must find the Parliament of Horses. They will judge this man for the crimes he has committed. There they are. The Parliament of Horses. The final say in horse law. The Prime Minister has delivered a verdict of guilty. This man is sentenced to community service and re-education. He will learn the ways of the horse from the Parliament of Horses themselves. Only then may he hope to atone for the crimes he has committed. I hope that you will learn the ways of peace and harmony with the horse, as I have. Just gonna pay off all my bounties. You must have done something mighty bad to be worth all this. Uh, hey, he cheated! Oh, no, 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 guys, it's okay, he cheated. He cheated, I'm just doing the... You know, the western thing when you shoot the guy who cheated at cards. Oh, that's not good. No, it wasn't that bad. You know guys, if, if I haven't had my coffee one day, don't, don't even talk to me, let alone start shooting at me, because I'm not even gonna have it. Just don't even, don't even talk to me until I've had my coffee. Don't even, don't even shoot at me until I've had my coffee that day. Alright, let's get coffee. Alright, let's do it. <laughs> Boom! Ba -ba -bam. My favorite part of the searchers was when John Wayne just shoots fucking exploding bullets at people. <laughs> Do you guys remember that part? From the... from the west. When people had their exploding bullets. 10 out of 10 for realism, Rockstar. We're all 
we're gonna die. <laughs> this guy, I swear. That's why I come to see you, Mickey. You just, uh, you just make me laugh. You're starting to rile me now, pal. You get the hell out of here. Huh. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to find another way in there. Just keep reaching for those guys. Hey, what you got going on in here, folks? A party? Reach for the stars. Reach for the skies. Reach for the skies. You reach for the skies. Where's it reach for the skies? Alright, lady, reach for the skies. <sighs> we'll kill you if you just reach for the skies. I told her. All right, reach for the skies. Okay, we might have a problem here. Hey, do you guys remember that part in Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid when they shoot the fucking exploding bullets at the cops? I think that's my favorite part of the movie. <laughs> guys, you're not gonna win. I have exploding bullets. Oh, there's a guy. You had a good idea, friend. And now you're dead. Oh, well, what do we have here? Another offender. Reach for the skies. You are under arrest for crimes against horse kind. Yes, my horse agrees with my decision. The parliament has delivered its final verdict. It is to be... Oh. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, sorry, buddy. Oh, are you okay? Good controls, Rockstar. 10 out of 10. Very immersive. Anyway, as I was saying, this man has been tried and judged by the parliament of horses. Their verdict? Death. By the iron horse. This is the place where the iron horse will carry out the sentence. Hey, delivery! Okay, I just realized that I don't actually have a train schedule. Okay. Um... I don't think a train is coming anytime soon. Oh shit, snake! Oh my god. Nature is terrifying, guys. But don't worry. Humanity has created a solution to deal with nature. There we go. Hey, wait a second. That's my line! Fuck you, you took my line! You shouldn't have taken my line. You know, guys, uh, uh, you know that I like to tell a joke, but uh, make sure that you put out your campfires. Uh, I know that's not really funny, but uh, not everything's a big joke, guys. Just put out your fires. Up, oh, right here. Right here, this is what I'm talking about. Hey, you there. Yeah, you. We got a problem. Put out that fire! Put it out! Put out that fire right now! Put it out! I told him. Put out the fire. Didn't put it out. That's what happens, folks. Yep, there it is. Well, that's it for this week, folks. Join us again next week for another exciting episode of Put Out Your Fire.